This is actually one of those questions that Ford owners ask each other more than they ask Ford. Because, honestly, the software update process for the F-150 can be a little confusing and sometimes it's annoyingly slow. Especially when you're sitting there, coffee in hand, dashboard lighting up, wondering, did I mess up? The Ford F-150, starting with the 2021 models, comes loaded with SYNC 4, which is a pretty impressive infotainment system when it works. Ford will tell you it's future-proofed with over-the-air updates, but to most folks, that just means, why do I have to wait 30 minutes for my radio to come back on? If you're one of those people who instantly get nervous about a blinking screen or frozen navigation, you're not alone. Those OTA software updates are supposed to download automatically, but half the time I see posts in forums like, it's stuck at 60%. Is my truck dead? No, it's just dramatic. Step one, if you want to force a software update. Pro tip, useful if you have spotty Wi-Fi, which is basically anywhere except the Apple Store, is to make sure your truck is parked, engine running, or in accessory mode, and definitely within reach of decent Wi-Fi. Not your neighbors, unless you're on good terms. Next, go to the sync screen, tap Settings, then System Updates. Here's where the real fun starts. If an update is available, it should say so. If not, hit Check for Updates. And if that spins forever, take a deep breath. That's just sync being sync. The update itself can take anywhere from 20 to 45 minutes, maybe longer if you're trying this during a thunderstorm. People report wild timing differences. Some get it done on a lunch break, Others are two podcasts deep and still waiting. Bring a snack. One huge pain point. If your Wi-Fi connection drops, the update might fail, forcing you to start over. And yes, you'll probably grumble the entire way back to the settings menu. That's not user error. It's just the price of modern convenience. After the update completes, most F-150s will ask you to restart the system or turn the car off and on. That's when you realize half your radio presets are gone. Maybe your phone gets weird with Bluetooth. It's not fun, but you can repair everything in less than five minutes if you know where to tap. There's real value here, though. A big update can fix bugs, improve audio quality, even boost navigation speeds. I've seen Ford roll out fixes that cut startup lag by 40%. Some people swear their trucks shift smoother, though I'm pretty sure that's psychosomatic. Here's my favorite pro tip. If you're planning a road trip, Check for updates at least a day ahead. Nothing ruins a family drive faster than your navigation system deciding it needs just a few more minutes to update, right as you're merging onto I-5. Ford also lets you schedule updates overnight. If you're the set it and forget it type, this is clutch. Go into system updates, pick a time when you're asleep and wake up to a refreshed system. Unless the Wi-Fi hiccups, in which case repeat steps one through 10. Will software updates turn your F-150 into a flying truck? Not yet, but they're useful for keeping everything running, plugging security holes, and occasionally adding new features. It's nerdy, but trust me, even 10 minutes saved in traffic navigation feels like a win. If you get stuck, don't panic. The Ford Pass app sometimes shows more update info than your dashboard, and the Ford online forums are gold for troubleshooting. Worst case, call your dealer, but honestly, Half the time, the answer is just wait a few more minutes.